Alrighty everyone, welcome to the next update of our FPS Unity Playmaker shooter system. <laughs> um, as you can tell I've made quite a lot of improvements in this update. I have full enemies running around everywhere shooting at me. Um, they'll take cover, um, flank me if they can. If you notice there might be some enemies trying to run around this area. Um, you have different zones that you can put people into, so then they'll activate once you get in a certain range, or their cone of vision um, spots you. Um, I've implemented a ragdoll system, so when you when you shoot them down, they'll um, they'll fall over and cark it. Um, also, the the third person system still works properly, so you can still run around and shoot these guys. They have um, you have set up weak weak spots, so hitting them in the in the gut which is where their little generator thing is um, does da um, extra damage so if you notice I'll pop them there and he'll fly across there and also if you run over to them they're um, active ridge bodies so you can still um, kick them around and stuff and jump into this view and if you notice in the top right corner um, we're still streaming at a really good frame rate we've still got um, around 90 frames per second which is um, really good for this stage of development Normally when you have lots of enemies running around, you'll probably be pushing around 25, 30 in the early stages. Um, but with my system, you're still running at 100 frames per second before you even have any environment in there, which is really good. Because normally AI takes up quite a lot of the memory. So this is a really good, um, simple system. And of course, you can really make the system as complicated as you want it to be. Um, let me just drag in what a simple um, enemy AI system looks like. Um, here you can see the kind of system that I'm running with. We're we're finding the player, and then the the idle enemy is looking for the player, and then we either we send it to move towards the player, and then in which it um, actually um, sends a ball to make it stop shooting, and then it decides to to stop running, and then we'll create a random action for the the enemy to do. He's either gonna go into a crouch position and wait for you for a little bit, or he's gonna run away. He'll either yeah, or he can move to a better location, which is um, in some cases going to flank you. He's going to move all the way around you. Um, and then it will keep cycling through these. So by the time I finish the system, this is going to be a really expansive SF, um, FSM. Uh, and it's going to really um, have a lot of different actions that the enemies can do and lots of branching things. So they might be able to um, pop up here and then come and take cover behind here. And then you can might, you can even hear them call out to say, hey, come over here and... Um, give me a hand and then in which case some of these other enemies might run up and start supporting these guys and I'll also have um, grenades impl implemented because I just finished um, sorting out the animations for that so they will be into the next update so they'll be able to flush you out and throw more um, grenades and everything in so let me just finish taking out these guys I'll move the mouse out the way so yeah and as you noticed um, I just died and you even have your own animation system so you can go full ragdoll and here we go everyone's still shooting at me they'll they'll start crouching let me take out a couple of these guys quickly you can switch into third person and you can even zoom in a little bit to get a better perspective of how your guy died and as you notice the respawn system is really quick as well minimal loading which is all part to some little enhancements that I've put in there a couple of little scripts um, which you'll get if you um, purchase the um, asset store system. And if anyone's wanting this um, system as an early beta or anything, just let me know in the, the comments and I can um, I can sort something out for you. There you go, you can take this guy down. Just kind of try and get this guy, there we go. Yeah, take that. Yeah, so this system is really expansive and um, like in the last update, you can still switch um, shoulders and that still works perfectly. And that's a very dramatic death. <laughs> uh, lots of fun. So yeah, I hope you you guys are liking what you're, what you're seeing so far. If you have any suggestions or anything that you want me to implement into this system, just let me know and I will do my best for you. Um, but this has been Kirin of Sapping for Filmstorm Studios. And I will catch you all in the next update.